is Lana Schammerger. In the past year, I have completed the neurosequential model of training for education. This training consisted of 80 credit hours um, designed around meeting students' needs based on their brain development. So, what that means is working from the inside of the brain out, starting with the brain stem and working through the diencephalon, the limbic system, and the cortex. M much of the training focused around um, trauma-informed practices um, aimed at helping students regulate their emotions as well as making classroom accommodations to help students process their emotions and build skills from the brainstem level out. The other part of this training focused on shaping teacher and adult behavior in our buildings to model emotional regulation for children as well as coping strategies to teach within their classrooms to help kids get through difficult situations. advisor and instructor here at Brush High School and this is the Beatbox. Um, this is something that we worked on last year in order to purchase with the Innovation CTE grant. Um, we designed the truck, designed the menu, designed some signature items. We still have some more signature items that we can turn around and develop from there. Um, but we did get to use the food truck twice this year. We did a soft opening for staff um, at Brush Secondary Campus about two weeks Ago. and then during homecoming we did a grand opening of the food truck for the homecoming tailgate um, at the football game um, we were very busy which was good we learned a lot we know there's some things that we need to improve on and we've already worked those out and we'll do implement next time hi my name is Yamara Ramirez I am a senior at Brush High School and I am in Pro Start 2 I am also certified in serve safe management and one thing I'm excited for this year with the catering food truck is getting it out to the student body and having everybody participate in it. And it's bringing our catering family together. What is your favorite part about the food truck? My favorite part about the food truck is being able to come together and work as a team to make everything come together. My name is Kenya Hernandez and I'm a senior here at Brush High School. I am in the catering program and I'm also in Pro Start 2 and I'm also Serve Safe Management Certified. What I'm most excited about to see in this food truck is seeing how we bring all of the Brush community together as a whole group. And what? Oh my God. My favorite part about the food truck is being able to work with everyone that's in the catering program because it brings all of us together and we all work as a whole group. My name is Adriana Gamboa and I am a senior in Brush High School in Pro Start 2 and certified in Surf Safe Management. And what I'm extremely excited about the food truck is coming together and hanging out as a family pretty much and then being able to just do a bunch of things for the student body. My favorite part is probably not having to take Suburbans everywhere and actually having a mobile kitchen, so I, that's going to be fun. BHS upcoming events. For parent-teacher conferences this year, as we've done last year, we have conferences on the 18th and 20th of October. Those will run from 4 to 7.30 p.m. on those days. And teachers should be getting a hold, if they haven't already, of each parent to set those times up. As far as events coming up, we have a drama play um, is putting on Clue, um, which will be on Friday, November or Friday, October 14th um, at 7, and Saturday, October 15th at 2 and 7 p.m. Prices for tickets are $7 for adults and $5 for seniors, veterans, and non-BMS students. Please make sure to check out the regional softball tournament this week. As Saturday, Brush High School hosts the Region 5 state uh, tournament. 
Games will be at 10 a.m., 12.15, and 2.30 p.m. Um, once again, that is hosted by Brush, currently ranked second in the state. Also, on our continuing schedule, we have eSports. We play a variety of sports, that being, if you don't know eSports, those sports being on the video game consoles. We have everything from Smash Brothers to Rocket League in the five games that we play. And those games are Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday every week. And we also broadcast those as we do all of our other games on YouTube through Digger Athletic Network. Make sure that you go on to Digger Athletic Network and subscribe for all of the updates and upcoming events, as well as subscribing to our new Digger Athletic Network 2 and 3, which will soon provide more content from Brush High School and Brush High School students. Um, this year, as an athletic department, we have an opportunity to partner with Kansas University and their sports psychology department. Um, and one of the lab groups that is um, surveying athletes uh, in regards to achievement goal perspective theory and the caring task involving climate. Um, basically, that's just a fancy way of saying um, we're trying to figure out the motivational climate for our athletes to understand how best to motivate them and how they enjoy being motivated as well as understanding the culture that our athletic department is cultivating in our athletes. So we're attempting to better understand our athletes so we can better assist our coaches moving forward. Thank you and have a wonderful day.